Hey Legionnaires and welcome back. We're here with another part of our 1212 AD campaign for the Abbasid Empire. Abbasid Empire? Well, it's Abbasid Caliphate really, but it is at this point. Look at it. It's a grand empire. We, uh, well actually, let's go on diplomacy. We stretch from the east all the way to the Mediterranean now. And our final aim to take out the Ayyubid Sultanate is, well, basically ready to go. All we just need to do, there's going to be a few rebellions that are going to go happen over here. We've got this army. Um here, which I'm probably going to just send against Homs. I've got this one sort of ready, but not quite just yet. I've got some other armies that are just getting ready as well. We've got this one. Antioch slowly being pacified, as is um, Cease uh, over here, but we should be soon ready to go uh, eastwards or westwards, I should say. I think, well, what are we building over here? We're building a cavalry army, of course. Um, so yeah, I think I'm going to, I think I'm going to do it. Right now, it's a big risk, but let's do it. Declare war. Oh my gosh, they have a lot of allies. I also have a lot of allies. So we'll have to see what happens. Now that words have now that so I've declared war on the Ubids. No one joined their side. I'll we'll just build a ram. The they have nothing in this area, nothing in this region. And we can start by assassinating some people. If we had some money, we could do so. Uh, Mecca has stayed on our side, so that is good. Uh, I can't do really anything with Mecca, so we're just going to just not do that. I'm going to end the turn. Probably give uh, this guy, I don't know. Could, um, yeah, there you go. Have your governor have some, some more religion and integrity. And taxes, please. That's, yeah, it's actually not massively hurt, the trade. It's only brought it down a thousand. I thought it was going to be more. Um... But thank you for, again for all the support in this uh, series. We are coming to an end now. I think it'll probably be this episode, maybe another one, just to capture all of the Ayyubid provinces. And then, uh, well, probably going to have a little break from campaigns while I think of uh, another one that I'd really like to do. Um, I, after so many parts, you kind of, it feels a bit monotonous. This one's kind of like, I've enjoyed it till the end. I will admit, this one's been pretty fun to play. But sometimes you got to, you kind of have that monotonous feeling when playing a campaign. So you've got to have a real think about what you're going to do. So we're going to probably have um, a siege week very soon. And we'll have a, another week just full of sieges uh, to entertain ourselves during this lockdown. I mean, though we're nearly at an end. With everything's starting to reopen in the UK. Whether it should or not is uh, up for debate. No, we will not have peace and 5,000 Ayyubids. We will not have any peace of any sort. I also kind of want to go to war with the Ayyubids, just in the off chance that uh, someone comes across from the west and starts to try and conquer their lands as well. I don't know where their armies are, the Ayyubids. They've got like some armies all dotted around the place, but nothing impressive. Nothing impressive at all. I'm, the biggest win was getting Mecca to stay, to break its like vassalage and then join me. It's not my vassal now. Rebellion there in Van, no surprise there. We had uh, some people die. And some attrition still, jeez. My lord, at your command. March. Just put this guy down. Let's kill. Have him killed. Excellent. Dead. That's what happens when you rebel against the uh, Abbasid Empire. Advance. So yes, my oldest ally is now my newest enemy. And. Uh, I'm just thinking what we can build in Van. It will allow me to select Van. Um, we're building a lot of happiness stuff. I kind of want to carry on going down that system. Do we need food? No, not just yet. We might do it in a minute though. Um, we'll put some fields in for now. They should help. Our economy's gone down again, but I just wonder how much that had to do with the trade as well. Um, I actually have the garrison here in Holmes as relatively big. Oh my gosh, that is a very big garrison. I'm going to bring this guy up, and then he can march back after we're finished here. Jerusalem joined the war as well, which is always good. Stabbed him. Excellent. Executed. Homs is ours. And we occupy. And then we return to Antioch as well. Oh no, let's just let's just become there. Thank you. Uh, we'll do, ooh, what shall we do? Could do charge bonus, could do militia, no. I mean, I'd like attack a rate, possibly. Morale when laying siege. 
Could do morale when laying siege. What have we got here? Enemy morale, melee attack, weak spots. Yeah, let's do that. Um, can we recruit any units here? No, we can't. I imagine Holmes has got a lot of damage stuff yet. Um, what is this? A mosque. Yeah, we'll just keep that there. Um, and we'll repair most of these. We can convert most of this stuff. Amir's estate. I'm going to knock that down. And we're going to knock down Holmes's castle as well. Okay, finally. Um, the diseases have stopped here. The disease has stopped. They've actually pulled back most of their armies. So I'm going to carry on just having a look around. There's no armies anywhere near here. Al Juaf is uh, nearly grown again. We can, we're probably going to put in like some to just deal with the garrison there. You're doing your thing there. Excellent. Mosul's looking happy. Van could be better. This place, let's put a pleasure house in. Um, Over in the east. Kerman, he's looking okay. Just about. Just about. Uh, and then, oh, it's the fan here. Have they got no, go I wonder if this has got no governor now currently. Yes, so it's the fan needs a governor again. Do we have anyone available? That could be a governor? I don't think so. Oh yeah, we do, this guy. Um, Let's make you the governor of Istifan then. Excellent, there we go, right. And then we've got you as well here, Yusuf. Well, let's see if we can do some uh, marriages first. My master extends because then I can get Welcome, friend. more money. Well more and strengthen some alliances but i don't think it'll be the case i think most people will be like no how dare you we don't have any more women to sell not a sell either i guess it actually it kind of is they're, they're giving me a dowry Just, that's pretty mad actually it's kind of like how medieval marriages went they were kind of just trade oh yes hi with them for trade yes and speak as you wish Yes, there we go. We'll have trade. Um, excellent, yeah. And we can't really do anything else. That's really annoying. I don't think these guys have anything to offer either. Do not waste time. But they're slowly improving. Um, they're not at war with any of these people that I went to war with, but that's kind of fine. Not too worried about that. Um, Basra's slowly going in happy in, a, in religion as well. We need to change that around. Get Sunny back. Back to the best. Um, and then let's do... Oh, okay. We've got some technology to do. We finally got that one. Ghazi Warfare. Don't really need any of these. I guess I'll put a copper foundry in and gold artisan. Not that I really need it. And then Yusuf over here can find a wife. Oh, you're married off already as well. Uh, okay, well, that's fine. Got lots of people just marrying off slowly. Ever so slowly. Family trees getting very big, but no one's actually joining. Okay, and Kufa's going down. How come you're going down? War weariness, difficulty, religious differences. So it would help if we put a foot for our headquarters in here. You'd expect. You'd expect. Acker is looking okay. Not much I can do there. Um, yeah, we'll end the turn and we will... That is a 98 and it's just now going plus 3. Wow. Oh, Istafan needs something. Okay. Have uh, have growth and wealth, I guess. And we'll see what happens. Yeah, I don't know why I need to know about him dying. It's not really the end of the world. England's still making its crusade across like western, uh, west North Africa, west well North Africa. We'll just say. Uh, I don't know quite where any of these armies are, um, like for the Hasfids. I feel like the AI, as soon as it loses an army, doesn't really feel inclined to remake it. It'd rather just spend the money elsewhere doing other stuff. Um, just seems like there's not much of a challenge after you defeat a couple of big armies. You just end up doing some just carpet sieges. 
that's the stealing problem with uh, 1212 at the moment, with its campaign anyway. Multiplayer is pretty spot on. I'm sure these things will be sorted. Oh look, like look at that. 10,000 they're going to offer me. There's no way I'm... I could take it, but I'm going to just get take your places anyway. Reduce them to nothing. Reduce your empire to nothing, in fact. I just hope that Akas stops star uh, like dying of consumption or whatever it is. I might just put the, the army into the sea and just see what happens. Not much more a man can do when uh, the place is already at, like, I don't know, three sanitation, I'm pretty sure. Castilian def pretend has gone swords of Islam. Are still dying. Rejection. Oh, no. Yeah, this guy is still dying. I'm going to actually move him out of the uh, of the region. That's going to bring it down to minus 18, though. That's a problem. It's the only issue. Catholic Christianity is going up. As well, it's not much I can do about that either. Um, I guess we could make this a walled city. Could make it a, uh, a fort again. Let's go with a walled city. We don't really need it to be a fort. Blacksmith, I'm going to knock that down. Let's put the Baelic garrison in and then let's convert this to a... Hmm, maybe a Grand Palace... But let's make it a pleasure house for now. That should do. Uh, and then Homs is actually looking okay. How bad is it? Like if I pull out, not actually that bad. I might just carry on. Start besieging Jerusalem. There we go. Just carry on. No one's business. What I'm doing here. What's in Damascus? Absolutely nothing. There is an army in Equaver. Let's assassinate him. I don't think we'll do it. Shoot him. No. He's failed. No surprise. He's only a level 2. They're like, oh, unusually he's failed. It's not really that unusual. Let's build a bigger... Let's make this even more sanitized here. I like... There's not much else I can do at this point. This place is like the most scrubbed region of the world. I've got like random 19 stacks. Just no, not bothered to make them 20 stacks. So bizarre. Um, these units over here are recruited. I'm going to send this army... Well, Gorgon's actually not happy, so I'm going to just send him back here temporarily. Just give it one more 12 and then we'll go east. And can I build another army? I could not build another army, even if I wanted to. Right. Interesting. This army should be able to take most of these regions on its own, like in the Sinai region. Then we can move on to Egypt and North Africa, probably in one to, like one more episode. Imagine. I imagine. I could be wrong. We may need longer. I don't think it'll be the case, though. For years, uh, Imam, um, he can first have a public order and then inspire. There we go. There we go. Kufa's now happy again. It is also annoying that I can't fully, like, convert a place to actually stay that religion. Like, it's just going to eventually go, no, I'm going to go back to Shia. And there's literally no one in the world, I don't think, that has Shia Islam at the moment. I could be wrong, again, but I'm looking, or I've been looking around. None of the factions have Shia Islam. Like, what is this? This, like, defense. Like, Pease is already sieging down Tunis as well. Where are ha the Hasford's armies? They're just going to, like, roll over. There's one here. It's a tiny little stack. And starving to death. He's not now. He's just hiding in a fort. Just going to decide just to give up, aren't they? Just What's the point? What's the point in this AI? It's not actually going to be a race for who's going to get to the Ubid's western territories first. Is it going to be me or is it going to be the Crusaders? Who aren't even on a crusade. They're just attacking people. Ironically, I've subjugated the only crusaders that are left. Jerusalem. Oh, here they come. I did think they might eventually. Uh, right. What's this army like? I would take this on uh, quite happily if there wasn't another... Uh, wasn't the garrison as well, I think. But um, I might need... Oh, there's 
Some more armies appearing. Interesting. Ah, here we go. This is where the showdown is going to begin. Who's going to break whose stacks first? I think I could take out that army with the garrison if I had two armies there. But one of the armies is just starving in Acker, which for some reason just won't stop starving. Well, not starving, but dying of disease. Yet the disease is gone. But hey, maybe the game just wants to punish me for just, I don't know, being too good. I don't know. At this point, yeah, it's just still starving. It's ridiculous. Oh, it's finally stopped. It finally stopped. It took, it made them go below half strength. And then they were like, yeah, that's it. Right, Salad, you don't need to be over here anymore, I've just realized. Military investment in Jerusalem is over. Yep. Yeah. It was very uh, temperamental. Right, well, who have we got here? Oh, we've got a spy from the Holy Roman Empire in Acre. Well, good for him. I'm not going to go and kill this goddamn priest because before he does anything stupid like bribing my units. There we go. Assassinate him. What's the garrison like in Damascus? Oh, tiny in comparison to Jerusalem. Yep, yeah, let's go and take out Damascus then instead. I'll bring up a second army and we will start to besiege that in a moment. Which one's looking the best or the most likely to not rebel? Actually, it could be Akka. Though this army is just so beaten up. Right, we'll send it around to here. No, we'll put it here so it just is safe. Uh, you and then... Hmm, yeah, let's do scare people. Let's reduce your, uh... Akka's, like, garrison's okay, but it's not happy that I've left. Not one bit. I mean, none of these places are. None of these places are, ha for some reason, like, overjoyed with anything. Right, Malatya, you're still not going to be happy, and I don't know why. What's wrong with you? Instability's going to go down at one. Wariness. Religious differences. Sunni Islam is actually going down in this region. What the heck? Um, let's get rid of this and then let's make that a mosque. Uh, what's the case here? Sunni Islam is going up. Religious difference is minus 20. Ye yikes, indeed. Uh, to Brits, you're quite happy and I'm not going to really mess with that. Erbil, Mosul, yeah, everything's happy here. I'm going to send the army that's in the east all the way back. It's going to come over here with its small selection of Mongol units. It should actually arrive in fairly good amount of time. Antioch's looking okay. I might start recruiting more troops for these units. Hmm. I need cavalry. And none of these armies have cavalry. This one has cavalry. Let's put some cavalry in this one. Yep. Cavalry. Cavalry. Three units of cavalry should do the job. Homs, let's make you... What have we got here? Plaza. Da, 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 da. We've got a fair amount of everything. Could put in muster grounds. Don't really want to though. Could put in... What's the food state like here? Food state is not good. That'll be the reason why that's not happy then. Yeah. Well, minus five on food. Religious differences is still an issue, but it's going up. That's fine. Right. So we dealt with that. Now Al Juaf was you've got a you've got yourself stronger. Let's put in a town barracks. What's the food like here? It's okay. Kufa, you're still not like overjoyed. My lord. Still a bit iffy. Right. Let's just do that. Bazar is now gonna slowly be changing again. Yep, so slowly going sunny Islam. Let's put a mosque in here. And let's make that sure that's going fully Islam. Uh, right, Wahid. Taxes, taxes. Muhammad. And taxes. There we go. More money coming in constantly. Always need to have money coming in. Especially when I'm going to be building up some big armies. There we go, right. Hopefully, we can take Damascus next turn. I don't think the Ayyub is, could get 
both those stacks to Damascus to save it in time. What is England doing? Good to see Sicily still like doing its thing, just conquering as well with England. I'm glad that I'm not at war with like Pisa. Even the Swiss, the Swiss are in Tunis, which has now been taken by the P by Pisa. What is this? What are the Swiss do? What are the Swiss? Sorry, doing in North Africa? This is what I think is so wrong with the, the only thing wrong with the game. No, none of the Christian nations will fight each other. I mean, none of the Muslim nations will fight each other either. Really, there needs to be more events added in by the dev team, like just to make these uh, nations fight each other. Um, but we'll we'll have to see what happens uh, in the next update. I'm not quite sure when it's coming out, but like for instance, no one will attack. Like, none of, there won't be much infighting apart from the Crusades, really. And that's just frustrating. And, yeah, here comes both the stacks. And we could have a big battle here on our hands. Um, I don't think I could fight this, mainly just because... Oh, I don't know. It's either here I fight and die, or it's... Uh, what's the cavalry state? It's like, I've got four units. I've got all this cavalry as well. It's not full strength. Um... They've got... Oh, they've not got great stuff. I'm going to fall back. Retreat, man. Retreat. Uh, and I imagine the other one we'll get. We'll do this, and then Retreat I can get this one to... Fall back. Actually, you're going to fall back? Yeah, okay, yep. Yeah. And there we go. Okay, so we can take out these armies one by one now. And then I can siege down Damascus. So we may have a big battle in our these on our hands in a moment. No, I'm not going to war with Georgia. I Their demands, they want my uh, daughter. Uh, I want money. I want a lot of money. I want a lot of money off you, sir. Well, that's still too much for this lo lovely young daughter I have. Uh, I'll I'll take a bit more. There you go. Three grand I'll take. And that'll secure the north in an alliance again. Or we can, uh, we can do something with her, that, hopefully. Anyway, let's see what happens... In a moment. I just really wanted to take Damascus at this point. Someone died. Assassinate Amory. Where the heck is Amory? Who the heck is Amory? I don't know. We found the Swiss though. Obviously. So that's good. I mean, that's good in a way. Everyone loves to see the Swiss. Right, we'll go there. Let's focus down this army. See if he'll fight. Nope, didn't think he would. Um, right, and then let's get... Oh, we can't go for this army. That's frustrating. Where'd that other army go then? If we kill this leader, I don't know if he'll move. Nope. Still, yep, you have failed, sir. Failed miserably. Shames this house. Um, where, my armies need to keep moving. Like this one especially. It's got some nice horse archers and some nice archers in here actually. Could do with these ghoulins. They keep producing. Ready for orders. I'm going to fall back for a turn. And I'm going to see what happens. Can we just fall back? Yeah, ever so slightly. Destination reached. Oh, maybe we shouldn't have bothered. Maybe we should have just gone for Damascus again. But that's frustrating. Can we recruit one unit here? One unit that's going to take a turn. Um, No, by the looks of it. Not a single unit will take a turn. Right, brilliant. Um, Akka may rebel, but um, not much I can do about that. Holmes, you're now... Minus one, because of the food difference that we put in, so that's good. Then we could put in... We could put in a Grand Mosque. That would be good, but I don't know what we'd do with that. Exactly at this point. Um, Aleppo is looking okay. I just want to free up an army. Need to free up some of these armies. Van. It's slowly getting there. I'm going to put in a Pleasure House and I'll put in a Mosque. Actually, no, let's not put in a Mosque. Let's put in a... Yeah, put in a Baelic garrison. Right. Can you just recruit a unit as well? Just a random unit. It's going to take like two turns. 
Put in some. I don't even have any of those crap archers. It would t just take one turn. Um, put in one archer then. Put in an archer unit. Four grand left. I'll use that spy needs to move as well. Ah, spilled that. Adara, help with the spread of Sunni Islam as well. I never Excellent. Right, so we'll do that. Um, Holmes, still doing its thing. Um, Imam, you can just start going there and then there. Kufa is slowly, conver uh, slowly converting again. Our giraffe is doing its thing. We've got. Uh, 1400 left in the bank nothing I can really spend on no mercs or anything like that still in the game frustrating times um, can you recruit you can just recruit the crap archers if I wanted you to uh, yeah we'll recruit two yeah recruit the two of them they'll hold the line um, and then that's it probably that's probably what I'm gonna do I'm probably gonna just end the turn Unless there's any... Oh, I can marry some people if Abdullah needs to find a wife. Let's do that. Um, any marriages to any random people? My friend. I imagine not. I imagine most of these people are just going to be like, no. Uh, why would I do that? Almahads. Welcome, friend. Uh, you be pretenders. I'm sure you Greetings, love me. Trade. Greetings. Yeah. I um, think with anticipation of your noble and worthy words. Just that's low. Okay, they're just how much money do you have? My they will have trade with you, and that's it. Mecca, please. Be nope, uh, Malachite of Oman. Welcome, friend. Welcome. Has no one got any wives to offer? Of I just need to get some more alliances please. going. Lewis of Toloi, I imagine you Yeah, I didn't think that would be the case. Uh, Cumans and Kipchaks. I warn you. Yep, I thought that would be the case. Volga, Bulgaria? Nope. Welcome. Literally no one. Literally no one in like what's left of this game has anyone available. Just seek a wife. Seek a wife, sir. Yusuf, uh, you can't do anything of interest. Um, hmm. You just become an Amir. So, yeah, there's not much I can do. Not much I can do at all there. You can become that. Excellent. Jafar, you can become a Amir as well. There we go. Right, just end the turn. And assign a character for Assad. Uh, I don't think there's... Oh, actually, maybe. There's a few things we can put in here. Armor, upkeep. Um, No, not really. We'll just put in... Just put in military instructor. And then we'll have that one and have taxes. There you go. Frustrating as it is to uh, find a, a way to break through this line of Abbasids, we should eventually find one. Not Abbasids, Ayyubids. We are the Abbasids. Of course we're going to find a way through. Look at the English, they're still putting down rebels. Because they don't. They just conquer the region and leave it. It's because the AI is so clever. Um. Oh yeah, Pisa now is just car besieging the next place. Look, they got like three stacks. Three pretty big stacks and Hasfids none and I don't even think I've seen a battle don't think they've seen them fight a single battle the Hasfids just don't haven't built an army or they have and it's all died in one go and they've not rebuilt idiots that's what I say um, I'm at war with like half the world at this point like it's slightly mad slightly mad Ayubids I imagine they're going to come and try and Fight me? Maybe? Oh, there's a small stack coming that way. They've got a priest here. Who knows? Georgia, Gurids, all sorts are going to... All sorts still to come, it would seem. I've killed, like, I don't know how many factions I've killed off, but I still haven't killed off that many, and this, is, this end turn still takes a long time. Malakate of Oman, one of my longest and oldest uh, allies up there with uh, the Ayyubids, to be honest. Oh, here we go. Someone uh, has died. Hussein died. Oh my gosh. Akra's. Uh, yeah, we'll put Yusuf in. There we go. He's now in the pride of Islam. He must. Uh, yes, take her hand. 
Yes, you can de decree. There we go. Right. Where is that assassin? You can kill this guy. Right, he narrowly escaped, but we, we got him. That's the main thing, All right? That and then the New Zeal. I could actually bring you all the way down here. How is Antioch looking? It's plus one. Let's do that. Let's make this a, a big big old stacks. March. We take this settlement for you, my lord. None will escape. There we go, no right. So you've done that. You can now move in here. You can now move in here. Make haste, men. And this guy now has all three armies supporting him. There's no way Damascus will be taken. It's This is the, the lengths I've gone to just to make sure that this army cannot be stopped. Right, we've got another right agent coming down here. We've got an army from the east now coming in that can now support in either governing or whatever the Holy Land. Cease is nearly happy. Plus five. What's the reason? Still religious differences. It's actually it is slowly going up though. It's slowly going up. I don't think. Yeah, I don't think there's going to be any agents I could recruit there. Uh, Baghdad is still looking okay. Kuf is looking okay. His agents can do some more stuff. Good for him. Uh, Advaz. Uh, I could put a better mosque in here. I really need to actually start boosting the economy again. Kerman's going down. That's an issue. We'll put a pleasure house in there and then we'll put a gold mine in. There we go. That's what we'll do. Istafan's still not that happy. Um, have that help with you with your issues in sanitation. And that's all the money again. All the money spent. Right, so we'll do one final turn. End the turn and we will take Damascus. And then in the next turn we should be able to probably go to war with... Uh, war. Take out Jerusalem, Quaba. We'll probably get into Egypt. Hopefully we get a battle as well against the Ayyubids. I didn't I could have fought some of those other ones, but I didn't want to risk it in at this late stage of the game. Lose those stacks and then have to like do another ten turns or something just to rebuild those stacks. It's better in Rome better in Rome too that you could just recruit in one turn most of the time. But th th then it takes two turns in twelve twelve is a bit frustrating sometimes. Oh, did they just like land and take that? They might have. Ah, oh, and there we go. There's a siege going on in Acre. Nice. Um, whether that will help or influence, who knows. I could kill that bohemian priest that just keeps walking through my lands. I might. Stop him from uh, coming back. He's walked all the way through the Holy Land so far. Just let's kill him. See what happens. They'll be very annoyed at that. Uh, the Ubids, I imagine, are just going to send stacks up. Oh, no, they're sending their stacks back. But the priest will carry on. A brave man. Braver than an army is that priest. And then we just got a few more. A few more factions go through. Um, Wales has not been taken by England. So I England decided, yeah, we, we won't take our neighbours Wales. But we'll go all the way down to North Africa and help them, like, fighting the Muslims there. At no point, as an Englishman, would we ever do that. We'd much rather f beat up the Welsh. Rebellion in Acre, yes. Ah, turn of the century, the 14th century, the end of the 13th century marks the da 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 da. Alright, there you go. It's been. Was there two rebellions? I don't know. I'm not sure. There's a food shortage again in Homs, though. So we'll put in. Uh, put in my camel herds. The heir over here can come and do his fighting against with the Justice of Allah. What a name. Right, yep. He's just going to probably fight him here, isn't he? Yep. Chop him down or hit him down, whatever. Take on the men. And then you can just stick there for a turn. Right. My lord. Um, Acre, I mean, slowly helping itself. I think it's going to be a rebellion in Antioch next turn, so I'll just go and put that one down and just help level him up. Um, you can kill this, uh, this guy, I guess. So he's funny. 
Oh, he's narrowly escaped, but he's got to go all the way back to Bohemia, so that'll be funny. And here we go, Damascus will be ours. It is ours. And no one can stop us. Damascus has returned to its rightful owners. And there we go, knock that down. Uh, yeah, I don't really want to stray a slave parlor. What's this, Ghulam? I don't really want Ghulams. Don't really want that either. Um, I was building something over here in Malatya. Ah, yeah, we were knocking this down to convert into something else as well. We'll, we'll do that next turn. Van is slowly looking happier, but still taking a long time. You can have something to go in here. Have Sunny Islam. Yeah, why not? Actually, no. That's good for a governor. If you're a governor. Um, just give you... Uh, I don't want to get... I'd rather get something for... Yeah, armor for cavalry units. You've got quite a lot of cavalry units. So have more armor in yours. It's really good. Battle movement speed. And then you can have campaign movement as again. So you can move even further. And then most of these stacks that have got just knocking about here, they can move on to Jerusalem. Move on to Jerusalem, and then we'll see what we can do from here. Really? I don't think there'll be anyone over here. They've abandoned Jerusalem now. Don't know where they've exactly gone to after that. Uh, have armor for commander's unit. Have armor for commander's unit. Armor for commander's unit. Look, he's going to be so beefy. Beefy boy with his armor. Yeah, okay, he's all the way over here. These stacks can definitely reach Jerusalem. Yeah. Well, or well, they... F eh, no, that's, he's on normal speed. Military... I think he's on normal military force. Morale, I don't know. Hmm, who knows? I don't know. I can't tell if he's on fast... <laughs> Forward march or whatever. We can try and kill this guy. See if it'll slow him down. Alright, so he narrowly escaped. So we've got damaged him. Got Damascus. Uh, you've been upgraded as well, so we'll do you. What is that? Harass enemy action. More casualties inflicted. I actually haven't got harass. Oh no, there we go. Assault units. There we go. Slowly, d slowly getting there. Slowly getting there. Antioch. I don't really know what I want to put in here. I guess we put in a higher Baelic garrison. That'll pacify the people. <laughs> more garrison. more To beat up more people. Uh, and then uh, you just got that to do. Nine. Nine. Nine, nine turns. Don't know. But yeah, so we are at the end now. I'm clearly uh, going insane as well. It's uh, the only apt thing to say. Actually, Nishapur is going to rebel. As could Gorgon. So we might need to send one of the armies... Eastward, probably the um, the one at Van might need to go eastward instead of going westward to help against the Ayubas. We probably won't need more armies here. Um, this one, I'm just going to get to recruit some more units. Going to get it to recruit some more. I think I'm going to get. Some, oh no, no. Let's get some melee cav. Yeah, three units of melee cav should do, or the shot cav. I oh, know they are melee cav. I was right first time. Um, and yeah, nothing there. No surprise. Holmes, how are you looking? You're looking okay, actually. They're actually happy now, so that's good. That's really good to see that's converted quite quickly. Um, so, yeah, if you've enjoyed, guys, please remember to leave a like, subscribe if you're new around here. And until next time, Legionnaires, I will see you guys later.